Okay, so Greg over there says he's 747. That's his nickname. So I was calling him Stretch last year and the year before. So I usually am the nickname giver. Me and the wife. But he wants 747. Tell me what you really think. One zero. Short return, gives Andy his favorite shot. But Greg so wins. Back, back. Back. Stay back. Uh, with Andy, it's a different game, so you'll have to figure that out. <laughs> <laughs> zero, zero, two. Uh. All right, let's just go some bang ball. And some... Yeah, you, you do kind of want to stay back with them. But poach when you get a chance with Andy, because it's open. Use your speed, Troy. I'll play around you if I need to. Okay, sometimes when you're talking, you hit a bad return. Like you're talking during timeouts. Oh, famous return. Can you run around that and set up, try to set up getting your forehand on those. I think it was coming in. That might have been coming in that corner, I don't know. Oh, great. Serve. Oh, smart. Okay, we got a little ring battle going on. A slap battle. Oh, who's going to win the slap battle? It's still going. Oh, he a reset. Oh, my God. Uh-oh. He survives. Oh, and Andy hits the net for the winner. I think I slipped into the kitchen anyway. Oh, okay. Well, if you didn't hit the ball. No, sure, yeah. So where are we? Two? Okay, see if he hit, You're he might have hit a volley and hit the kitchen. That's what he, two, two? he was thinking. Yeah. Okay, two, two, zero. Two, zero. Uh, better return. Nice. From the backhand, I don't know. That might have been going out. You're going out? Oh, yeah. Yeah. I mean, you were up 10 foot there. What do you think? If a 6'8 uh, guy six, yeah. has to jump from the baseline and hit the ball, it's probably going out. Zero, two. Okay, zero, two. Good serve. Excellent return, a little go, go. skip hop. Oh, look at this match going on. And there's a gap created. The mystery hit the gap. Half out. Get crazy stuff and four o ball. Two. Crazy four o ball. Two. Oh. And you like to drive. Just missed. Side out. 2-0. He said 0-2, but it's 2-0. Oh, he's on fire on his search right now. Oh, gave a short return, but Troy's got a good block. And it's out. Woo! Okay, second serve. Can you just serve? I mean, just you? Nah, second serve. 2-0-2. 2, zero two. two, zero two. Nice deep serve. Good. I can't punch it, but he needs to try to go. Oh, nice shot. Trying to go back to server zero if you two. can. Try to return back to One. server. Unless there's a stack involved. Good deep return. Sets up a missed third. Zero two. Two. Zero two two. two. Oh, excellent. Oh, and if Andy was up there like he was supposed to be, he would have had that shake and bake. But instead, it drops in front of him, gets a netter, and then creates a gap. And 747 hits the gap. 201. Oh man, he's on fire on his serves. Andy's sitting back. In, right there. In the basement. Sitting back in the basement, trying to play tennis. Baseline tennis. He left his backhand return. <laughs> that was short. And mystery had the whole world and just hit it in the net. Uh, and he's stuck in the midcourt. And still. Oh, he gets to the kitchen. Excellent. A lot. It was out. Oh, that was a little late. <laughs> it was out. Was it? Yep. 
Just out. I actually couldn't tell from where I was at. You served that, or I served it. Well, it was probably out. I think he was going to see if he could hit it Zero and then three. play it, because it is rec ball, but he was out. Once you miss it, you just call it out. Back in drive. In front of his partner. If you attack diagonally in front of your partner, you get yourself in trouble. You get your partner in trouble. Zero three, two. Spin return. Oh, what a drop. Look at nice safe in the middle. And then it's just slap ball. And then you're just hoping you get it over and slap ball. Oh, serve to the backhand. Driving serve. Got him. Excellent serves over here. Oh. So short returns. You are in trouble with a short return. You better be ready. You might as well just stop and hit the tracks and wait to hit the ball. Don't run into the flames. Oh. Okay, he got tracks behind the baseline. He had a nice drop in front of himself. Uh, the dink was too deep, so it gives him a volley. And then you got to move over and cover middle. And then he just hit the gap. Dean knows where the gaps are. Whether or not he can hit him, that's a mystery. Six. Zero. Okay, six zero. He just neglected to say the third score, so who knows? Oh, excellent. Oh, he gets it. He uses the wind. Rides the wind into glory land. Sometimes it just goes well. Seven zero. It's going to return. Excellent drop. Back in the back in the corner. He went straight, which was a good shot, but he was still moving to get set up to hit that block. Got to get set, folks. Oh, and then he rips it backhand out. I told him to try to try to move to his forehand, hit those returns, but I guess the lesson is over. I dropped. Good backhand attack. Uh, yes. You yeah. can go ahead and take those. I was, I was going to, but I was so embarrassed by my last drop. <laughs> I knew one or two. Uh, uh, Dean, those are yours. One. Oh, I know. No, okay. Huh? Nine zero. We're going to start saying that third number. We're going to take it away. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I hear you. I made a comment about that. That's it, the third number, guys. All right. This is part of the game, is keeping the correct score. It's hard enough to keep the score without saying all the numbers. You gotta say what server you are. And you gotta say it loud enough for everybody to hear. And then, I don't think Andy said the score at all. After he complained about the score. Andy, did you say the score at all? No. So you skipped all three numbers, not just the last one. Oh. I was commenting how you got to say all three numbers and say it loud, and I didn't hear it. So. Wow. He didn't say it. Uh -oh. well, excellent return, but he hits one smack up in the middle high. And it gets smacked. So, you know, we don't hear the score, we can catch the ball and have you redo it. Loud. The point is this way when you say it. 9-0! There we go. We all heard that. Excellent score call there. Excellent. Oh, hits a drive because Andy was sitting back. Puts that one high though and it's going to go down. It's a great, a great finisher by Troy. Put it down at his feet. You don't have to hit 1,000 miles an hour. Just put it down at their feet. Make him dig it out. 902. 902. Commence the ass whooping. Great serve. Hitting his backhand. Oh! Maybe Gray wasn't set. I think he was set and he just tried too much. 901. 091. And he's playing the baseline bang, and it's not working out so well for him. 
And then his partner doesn't know what to do at that point. I'm teaching him how to be a good partner, and then he's got to play this way. But that's that's what you're going to get in rec ball. you got to be able to play with everybody, and you have to adapt. You're not going to teach somebody who likes to play baseline to come up to the net. We've tried for three years with Andy. It's not going to work. Every once in a while he does, but then he reverts back to his old style. He likes to hit it hard. So. But anymore, everybody can get it back. Nine one. One. Oh, excellent return. Spinning deep to the baseline. Great return. And look at the result. We got a netter. Nine one two. Nine one two. Good safe serve. Oh, oh, it's good. Oh, Dean gave up. Hit his best drop his whole life, and he freaking sat on a stool behind the baseline and gave up. Well, that is sad. That is sad, folks. And now he's so flustered, he's hitting benches. <laughs> Pause. I have to hit pause in the video here. That was a bing, bing, bing. That's right. Put him down. One nine one. Excellent serve. Short return. Let me get it hammered. And yeah. the shake and bake. Yeah. And the shake and bake. So if you hit a short return straight in front of you, be ready for a rip right at you because you're the guy moving. And you're the guy they're going to hit it at, just like that. So you better just get ready. Okay, we didn't go back to server. And it went straight to the guy moving. And you're in trouble. It's better, it's better to go back to the server, guys. Return back to the server. There's higher percentage. Another one straight ahead. And it went out. Oh, no. Return back to the server. You got more court to work with. You got more time. You get a close to gap between you and your partner. It's just a higher percentage. Oh, we got a dink battle. He puts it high in the middle. I mean, too. It was too deep. Not low enough. Too deep. So Andy got a paddle on it. Hit his sharp backhand. Andy wants you to hit a deep to him. That's a shot. Don't give him a shot. Okay, cross court, dink, a third, the high third, so it worked out perfectly. He turned it back to server. He got a high third, put it away. That's nice, back to server, went forward. He's ready, because he's set. So your partner wasn't in trouble, and then he just tried too much, tried to get too much out of it. Turn it straight again, but he put some lofts on it. Oh, nice way to get back. There's no switch in there. He puts it up high. Oh, Andy was in his position. He would have had it for a kill. Look, he's moving backwards, backwards, backwards. That's not good. Nine, six. Nine, six, oh, nine, six. Big comeback over there. Comeback off of bad choices. Okay, had a short return, just got lucky because he wasn't ready for it. It's 962. 962. Spinning short return. It was so short that he had to come slow, but you better get up there on that return. Folks, hit a shot on your return that gets you to the line right away. Not that takes you six shots to get to the line. You can hit it, a log, return, and get to the line. Get to that line. Put some pressure on the R team. 10 to 2, game point. Oh, no, no. This is the dink. All right, crazy 4-0 game. That's 4-0 ball.